Hey everybody, this is Patrick with Patrick's House of Cards. Today we're going to have kind of a special day. Uh, when I opened up the Heritage Minor League last week, I forgot to open up the top loader, box loader. I didn't open up my two rack packs from my uh, jampacks.net old school box I'm going to open up. And I've got mail from Extreme Breaks. So we're going to start with the box loader. Let me get my knife out. We have a very special guest tonight with us. It's my wife Amy. She is the benefactor of all of our fun. She's not going to say anything, but everybody say hi. Thank you. And we've got the dogs in here. So it looks like we've got a Casey Mize. Look at that. It looks like a coaster you would put a drink on. That's all I'm saying. Well, it's Casey Mize. All right. We'll put him back here with our Jim Rice auto that we got and our Jim Tomei rookie card. That we scored. Let me move the knife. Leave the knife there. Grab the pink scissors. Purple scissors. And let's open up these. These are the 90, 1985, I believe, rack pack. So I'm going to have to cut them. And I am wearing my glasses today. But still, I can't see worth a darn. But I wanted to open these up on camera. We've got a Dick Williams. Forsh, Bob Boone, one of the Boones. What is it? Bob. What's, I can't remember. The manager for the uh, Yankees and then the other Boone. You know what I'm talking about, guys. Fill me in. Got to hold them up a little higher. I've got the uh, camera set just a little bit higher today. That'll go to my boy Brent. To Pete O'Brien. Bill Stein. Vukovic. A Pena, that's a nice Tony Pena. Nice Angels card for all you Angels fans like me. I hope that, it, oh, it's Mike Sosha. Nice card. Speaking of the Angels, World Series winning skipper. I hope that everybody's having a good Monday. Hope you had a great Easter. Hope that uh, you got to spend time with your family, even though you really can't leave. But I hope that it was a good, I had another Dick Williams. That's weird. Hopefully, we'll find the uh, Mark McGuire rookie card in here. Wouldn't that be crazy? All right. Yeah, that would be the Mark McGuire rookie card. Wookie, wookie card. No, it wouldn't be. The Wookie card is 80. No, it would be. No, it wouldn't. These are 86. That would be 85. My bad. Doug Flynnville train. Len Barker. Luis Salazar, we've got a turn back the clock, Roger Maris, 1961, very nice, it's a nice card, it's pretty nice, we'll set that to the side, I kind of like that, okay, why are they all different directions, Mike Jorgensen, we've got a Ricky Adams, we've got an Angels leader, that looks like, a, who is that, Bob Gritch, Picked it on front, Bob Gritch. Continuous service since November 24th, 1975. Okay. Uh, not sticking, but we'll get there. Randy St. Clair. Another one for my buddy, Brent. Mark Clear. We've got some Brewers, Ted Simmons. It's a nice picture. We've got an Indians leader. That would be Andre Thornton, Dean of the Indians, Luis De Leon, and Mark Davis. And we'll finish our 86. In two, one, two, three, four, five, six seconds. Here we go. Throw the trash over there. Y'all, I need to close up my knife. Safety first. I had my knife open over there, which is not smart because I'm really clumsy. And I would probably take a finger out. Then I couldn't open up the cards. Then my wife would have to do it. And she's not even talking. She's just looking at me like I'm stupid. So we'll just let it go with that. But like I said, it's nice to have her here. She works from home. It's about 6.30 on a Monday. She's off work finally. She's been working since 7 o'clock this morning. So she's just kind of unwinding and enjoying all the fun we're having here. At Patrick's House of Cards. Or as like my friend John calls it, Peahawk. Peahawk. Kirk McGaskill. 
Kurt Young, Burke, Denny Gonzalez, got a Steve Murrah, Mura, and a Mike Jeffcoat. So that does our 86s, y'all. So we'll go ahead and set them to the side. We'll put our Maris in our league leader card. And we'll open up. This would be 88. If I'm not mistaken. This is 88. An 88 rack pack of tops. This came, like I said, if you just now tuned in, this came with the... Uh, jampacks.net old school box which is just amazing we opened it up on saturday it was a long long video that's why i kind of didn't open these up i was going to save it for later rookie gold cup indians leaders look at dawson got a willie randolph for my most hated team the yankees it's a nice astro card for my buddy a benito santiago and we'll finish with a Don Baylor. Rest in peace, Don Baylor. It's been a couple years since he passed away, but he was a good manager. He was a good player. I really like Don Baylor. All right. Rob Deere. Got another Angels card of Doug Descendants. Oh, now it says now with the Cardinals. Well, well, well. Okay. Kevin Bass, Icorn, Terrell, Bud Black. Isn't he a manager somewhere now? I believe he's a manager. Terry Pendleton. I remember Terry Pendleton specifically with the Braves. So he must have went to the Braves not too long after this. Stillwell. Nice Robin Yount. Nice Tim Raines. Two Hall of Famers back-to-back. -back. Ron Guidry. Well, that was a nice pack. Our section of our pack. What do y'all think about Tops and Panini stopping production of all their cards and all these cards getting pushed back? Is that going to force you guys to run out and get some some of the earlier stuff? The earlier 2020 product like Series 1 and Gypsy Queen? I know that I saw on my Discord, AIAB Discord, that um, the Gypsy Queen has jumped. I think he said $40 in price already, like in one day. So I think that's it's starting to trickle down to uh, people trying to snag up boxes of cards because there's not going to be a whole lot, I think, this summer. I mean, there's a nice Dave Winfield. I don't think baseball season is going to play this year. I don't think. I, like it's, I don't think NBA is going to be back. The NHL isn't going to be back. They're doing the NFL draft virtually. Nice Jack Clark. And Jose Uribe. I don't know. I don't see it happening. I don't think this playing the games in – Arizona, you know, all these, I just don't see that working. I, I see that being a problem for, for some people, some of the players. I mean, some players that have, could have children born or, you know, events that they can't partake in. I think they'll choose watching their kid being born over playing baseball. So, and I'm not mad about it either. I mean, I just want everything to go back to, I wouldn't say normal because we never really were normal, but everything go back to a easier pace and not as stressful for everybody because it's just not a, it's not good. And I don't like it. This is the second time we've gotten cards from Extreme Card Breaks. And he does package them up very well. See? Two, dub two bubble mailers and then also wrapped in cardboard and taped up. And, I mean, you can't beat it. And I think all these cards combined cost less than cost me less than 9 bucks that I used with my allowance from last month. Which, again, we have to thank my wife, Amy, for, like I said, the benefactor of our party for me to get these cards. She's laughing. She's so cute. She's laughing and she's cute. And she's on her phone. But she had to be a part of the break tonight because she just wanted to give me good vibes. So here we are. This is it for us tonight after this. I have more cards I'd like to open. It's just... um. With her working from home and then my daughter doing school from home, it's hard for me to watch all five dogs during the day, kind of, enough to do a break without the dogs losing their minds. So, we'll see. Okay.
here we go. Nice. There, there's the information for Extreme Card Breaks. The owners, what is it, Jason Fendish. There is all the information you need. Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, eBay store. Really easy guy to work with. I'm telling you, he's got so many nice cards in there. Really great prices. And it, it, I ordered this like five days ago, and here it is. So, And it's always well packaged. Comes in top loaders, team bag, everything. There's this card. Okay. We're going to start here. We picked up a Jacob Pearson. It's the first Bowman. 2018. For the Angels. We picked up a Logan Ice. This is not a first Bowman. I believe this is also from 2018. 2017, I'm sorry. Excuse me. Purple. I believe this is number two. Was it numbered or was it not numbered? It doesn't appear to be numbered. It's still really a really nice card. We've got a Darius Baisley for the uh, Oklahoma City Thunder. I don't usually do basketball cards, but the Thunder are my favorite team. My favorite team, of course, was the Supersonics, but then they, then they became the Thunder. So I decided to pick up his rookie card. Really, I think it was a buck fifty. So and a prism. Then we've got two Detroit Tigers. Shout out to Grant. Got two 2018 Matt Halls. We've got one in the silver and one in a blue. And the blue is numbered to 150. Let me see if you can. It's right up there, guys. I promise you it is. So. And this one is numbered to 499 out of 499. So that would be our video for today. I hope everybody had fun. Hope that you will come back and watch my new videos and leave wonderful comments and tell me what's going on. And on behalf of my wife, Amy, my dogs that are all laid out in here, this is Patrick with Patrick's House of Cards signing off. See ya.